Okay, I can see the filament is broken. That's probably why it doesn't work anymore. So anyway, here's what's happened. Oh, about uh, an hour ago now, we had a big thunderstorm move through Winnipeg. And uh, lightning was flashing and one of the bolts of lightning must have been very close to the house because it was sort of like flash bang, you know, right away. And uh, anyway, uh, about five, ten minutes later, the power goes off for about, oh, ten minutes. And uh, my backup system kicks in and I shut everything down. Anyway, uh, it got me thinking about electricity. And then I remembered one of my night lights is burned out. So I start, you know, you get, got nothing else to do except sit here and wait for the power to go back on, right? So uh, I thought, you know, I, I wonder if I've got any more of those little uh, five watt bulbs. And uh, the answer to that is probably no. And then I thought, you know what, I do have one of these uh, LED bulbs. And it's, uh, uh, according to the box here, I think it's uh, 9.5 watts. So I thought, why not use one of these bulbs in the hallway, uh, and that would illuminate into my bedroom and into the bathroom. So that if I have to get up in the night, what do you mean if? I mean when I have to get up in the night and go to the little woodworker's room, uh, you know, I, I, the, everything is nice and bright. I mean, uh, one of these is going to be, well, I, I didn't measure it, but I'm guessing probably a hundred times brighter than one of these. Yeah, probably. Um, I could use the light meter on my camera and actually figure it out. However, not going to do that. Uh, but anyway, after the power goes back on, I'm starting to read all this stuff, and it's uh, you know it's all the all the usual data on the side of it. Uh, here we go: 2,700 degrees Kelvin, 9.5 watts, 120 volts, 60 cycles, 750 m. What's that? I thought I knew it all. Anyway, maybe I'll Google it after. But here's the thing that, that caught my attention. 145 milliamps. Well, without even trying, I know that 145 milliamps at 120 volts is more than 9.5 watts. Um, now this, I'm thinking, how, how could this be? It's almost double. Actually, I brought up the, the calculator on the, uh, on the computer. I was curious. And it comes to 17.4 watts. Uh, you now, here in Winnipeg, our, our power isn't a full 120 volts. Usually when I measure it, it's around 117, 118, uh, you know, depending on, I guess, what kind of draws going on in the neighborhood. It's pretty close to 120. I'm interested in crazy stuff, I know. Anyway, it's 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 17.4 watts, not 9.5 as advertised. Here we go again, false advertising, right? So, um, now here's, I thought about it for a while and I thought, okay, maybe this is the answer. It's alternating current. I know that from when I was fooling around with LEDs, little LEDs and, <clears throat> excuse me, and uh, transistors and all that kind of stuff, an LED only likes to, to work if the electricity flows one way. Now with alternating current, one minute is flowing one way, I mean one sixtieth of a second is flowing one way and the other sixtieth of a second is flowing the other way. So maybe it's only on half the time. Uh, is there anybody out there that actually knows or has taken one of these bulbs like my multimeter won't measure uh, AC milliamps it'll measure DC milliamps really good but it won't measure AC milliamps maybe there's somebody out there in YouTube land that 
knows a little bit more than I do about this kind of stuff and uh, actually has measured to see is one of these actually drawing what it's supposed to or is it another case of false advertising somebody just you know the manufacturers of these overpriced LED bulbs is uh, you know uh, slipping the government money under the table you know I'm very skeptical lately I don't believe anybody anymore I mean, just have to watch my own YouTube videos and all the false information that's going out. But usually I do correct it the next day. Anyway, uh, yeah, so if there's somebody out there in YouTube land that actually knows, uh, for sure, comment. If you're just guessing like me, you know, let's see if it's somebody that actually knows. Now, back to finishing editing today's episode. Thanks for watching. Now I just checked over my channel and this is the fourth video I've made now on these LED light bulbs. I hope it's the last one. What else can I say?